<laughs> all right. All right, uh, Mike. Before we let you go, we're about to get into our off-topic Friday. And so I want to ask you, what is on your sports bucket list? And I was thinking about uh, Max and I were talking yesterday. Uh, honestly, the uh, an Army-Navy football game. Yeah. Yeah. Um, is one of the the few things in college athletics that I I want to experience that I haven't. So that would be high up there for me. Uh, the Masters because I you know I play a lot of golf, so the yeah. Masters uh, would be good. And then El Clasico. Yeah, uh, El Clasico would be, would be nuts. Yeah, would be yeah. number three. He is Mike Craven. Follow him on Twitter at Craven Mike, where you just take the first name and you make it last, and you make the last name and you make it first. It's really easy. Um, also, like James Bond. Yeah. Also, I don't know if we've had you on since then, but uh, congratulations on your pending nuptials. Oh, thank you, sir. That's uh, you've you've joined the Outkick your coverage. Uh, yeah, I don't uh, know how you team. tricked her into that. You, I, awesome. I don't. Man, I don't know how you did it either. But uh, good work. Ha- Free ha- access to a lot of uh, sporting events, guys. Yeah. Yes. yes gotta, absolutely. Yes. He's yeah. got he's got the ability to apply for credentials. That's exactly <laughs> it. Mike Craven. We will see you in uh, San Antonio next week. See you guys Sunday. There he goes, Mike Craven. DCTF senior writer. We are DCTF Live. We're here every weekday at noon on TexasFootball.com, talking football on the Lone Star State. Follow us on Twitter, likes on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and we have a website. I will explain what, what happened. So I am ordering... Yes, um, this was it seemed very <laughs> distraught there. So I'm, I'm ordering Jimmy John's mm-hmm. to my house. Yeah. Okay? I'm ordering Jimmy John's to my house. And normally when I order it to the office, mm-hmm. we li- we we are operate in, a, in an office building, and we're kind of back in the back, and it's kind of hard to get back there, right. back here. If you don't know where you're going. Right. And so I usually go out there and get it. It's just a lot mm-hmm. easier than explaining mm-hmm. it. Mm-hmm. Um, and so normally I have the, I have Jimmy John's call me when they're in front. Yeah. They call me. Or, and, and so, but I ordered it to the house, to my yeah. house where my wife is. Yeah. And so I get a call from a Chicago number yeah. on my phone and I go, okay, what, what's I'm this? About, about I, but I am about to go to Chicago. Right. So then I G chat. My buddy in Chicago, who I'm staying with, I'm like, hey, are you calling me right now? Yeah, He's like, no. Uh, no. And then yeah. I get a text message that says Jimmy John's is up front. And I go, oh, crap. Did I order it to the office? Yeah. I go back and check the receipt. No, I didn't. Yeah. Which means my wife is just asleep at the wheel. Ugh. So I don't know I don't know what happened. But uh, <laughs> I, I, so I was trying to text Rebel, be like, hey, Rebel, can you go get my Jimmy John's? Because I think it's outside. But then I'm like, no, it's not outside. I'm trying. Whatever. That was, it's, wow. That was okay. It was a lot. Okay. All right. So let's talk sports bucket list. Okay. Because, and we'll, we'll wrap this up pretty quickly, because I have to get on a plane. Yeah. Because I am heading to Chicago this weekend for yeah. Rangers versus Cubs. Pretty awesome. And one of the things on my sports bucket list has been to see my beloved Rangers mm-hmm. play at Wrigley Field. Right. Uh, and obviously they play in, in different leagues, so it doesn't happen very often. It happens once every like six years. Mm-hmm. Um, it's like, um, what's something that happens every six years? Nothing. Uh, nothing. Nothing. So yeah. it's like nothing else. The World Baseball Classic? No, so, that's every four. So I am um, So I'm getting on a plane here in about two and a half hours yeah. and taking it up to Chicago yeah. to w- see I'm going to be at the game Saturday. I'm going to be at the game Sunday. By the way, listen to the ticket in Dallas, 8 to 11 a.m. Uh, on yes. Sunday. Another shameless uh, the sh- plug. The shake joint. So this is, um, this is crossing something big off my sports mm-hmm. bucket list, which mm-hmm. got me thinking about sports bucket lists. Yeah. So Max, yeah. I think you crossed a big one off your list. Yeah. This past, mm-hmm. uh, this past February, March when you April. went. April. April. Yeah. It's close. Yeah. Um, when you went and you saw your beloved Reds play yes. at Liverpool. Liverpool. Yeah. And and so what is what I imagine that was very very high on your sports bucket. It was list. numero uno. That's one. Yeah. Same play. Um. So past ones I've been able to cross off. Uh, definitely Red Sox at Fenway. Um, seeing Liverpool in general, I watched them on their American tour many times and then went over to Liverpool. I would agree with Craven, El Clasico, uh, mm-hmm. at both mm-hmm. the new camp and El Bernabeu. That mm-hmm. would be pretty awesome. Mm-hmm. World Cup final. Uh, a lot of people have submitted that. I'm going to put some of their tweets up here in a second, read them off to you, see what you think. Mm-hmm. Uh, College World Series. Okay. I have always wanted mm-hmm. to just like do a two-week binge at the College World Hall. Series. Huge, huge fan. That mm-hmm. would be a lot of fun. Uh, hopefully on one that's not like 98 and humid the whole time, mm-hmm. which apparently is all of them. Um, let's see. Can I can I throw one out there that's on mine? Sure, go for it. Japanese baseball game. Yes, another for me. I would love to go to a Yomuri Giants because game in Tokyo. It is yeah. just crazy town banana yeah. pants. Yeah. First of all, I'm obsessed with Japan. I think yes, Japan is absolutely. amazing. Yeah. So that's on my sports bucket list. 
Um, I've been to the Olympics, and yeah. honestly, no. more like the Olympics yeah. or the Olympics. L- Olympics? Yeah. You know, I'm uh, trying to add meh to yeah. Olympics. I'd love to go to Game 7 of a World Series, but that's, like, really tricky logistically whenever it happens. I've been to, I've been to like, eight or nine World Series games in my yeah, life. Yeah, I've been to World Series like games, six, but yeah. a Game 7 would be amazing. I don't even care who the teams are. Yeah. I don't think I could handle it if it was my team. Right. Um, two others. USA, Mexico at the Azteca mm-hmm. because apparently you fear for your life the whole time. I would want a security Because who wouldn't want that? Yeah, I know. Uh, and uh, I would love to see uh, River Plate Boca down in Argentina. That would be um, another one that you need a security detail now for. Here's, here's, if you ever watch that on TV, it is easily the craziest soccer game you'll ever watch. Mike, like They don't even finish the game half the time. Mike Craven mentioned Army-Navy. That's a great one. And that would be an awesome, awesome, awesome atmosphere. I never, I never went to a Texas A&M game. Yeah. I never went to a, a, an Aggies versus Longhorns game. And obviously, we're in favor of it. Um, <laughs> but I've, I've, I don't know. That's, that's something that, as far as football games are concerned, that's on my bucket list. Yeah, I've done that. Is yeah. to see them, see them do that. I don't, I don't really have any interest in like the Super Bowl. Yeah. Um, but the World Cup would be very cool. What What are some of our listeners saying? Okay, we, we so solicited here's, here's, some, here's some of the. We have some great ones here. Mm-hmm. We have. Uh, let's see, uh, Carlo Garza, mm-hmm. World Series, the CrossFit Games, College CrossFit World Series, CrossFit Games yeah. is interesting. Texas versus Texas A and M football at Kyle Field specifically. You know what? Yeah. All due respect to our Longhorn friends. Yeah. That's where I want to see Texas and A and M. Yeah. I'm I want to see it at you, Kyle. Yeah. Okay, yeah. because. That place will just be berserker. Yeah. Um, we have one. Our UK fan wants to fly over from the UK to see Longhorns play A&M or TCU. Okay. I can see that. Yeah. yeah um, let's see what else we got here. Some There's some good ones. Um, Jeremy World, Ballou says yeah, World, World Cup, Cup final Premier League match in England. Uh-huh. Yeah. You've done the Premier League thing. Oh, it's. I have not. Tell, I'm telling you. It's uh, it's great. To, uh, here's one from Curtis D. Stinson to attend a Dallas Cowboys yeah. Super Bowl game yeah. that they win. Yeah. See, now that's interesting. Yeah. I'm going up there to the Rangers Cubs, and I'm going to see you, Darvish, on Saturday, and I'm going to yeah. see Cole Hamels on Sunday. Right. I think I'm probably going to see one win. Right. Um, I think I'm. I think they're going to split that. Yeah. Hopefully, yeah. but at the same time, if they lose both, I'm okay with it. Right, you're just it's the experience because I'm there. Yeah. So mine aren't necessarily because yeah. you saw Liverpool win, which is nice. no, it was a tie. Oh, it was a, it was it was a draw. A tie. That's right, it was a draw to Spurs, then, right? Yeah, and then the last uh, Red Sox game at Fenway, one zero loss to the Tigers in the ALCS. Oh. oh my God. Um, our our um our intern Trevor Stiff, um, yeah. says that he wants to go UT A and M. Uh. Uh, that's that's a big one on here yeah. again. A lot of people bring Calvin that up. Bring Bowers. it back. Shocking. Um, a guy right. said, uh, "See an NBA uh, NBA Finals Game Seven Cavaliers and Warriors next season." Yeah, I mean that's yeah. that's as far as basketball games or, yeah. or concerned. And then here's I think this is my favorite one. Chase Wilder at Wild Wild Chase on Twitter. Yeah. Retire, rent or buy because I'm retired and super rich. An RV. Yeah. Follow College Game Day around oh the country my God. and see a new venue every this week. This is great. That's a great one. That's a great That's one. That's a really, oh really good gosh, one. Oh, my gosh, man. There's a lot of moving parts there, but uh, like to be like— I the- love the concept of an entire season bucket mm-hmm. list, yeah. right? Like, I'm just going to go where the madness goes. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's so and great. Be, and, it, and, like, be the guy— Like, like uh, if you've ever read the article about how they get the Washington State flag on, yeah. it's really, really interesting. Yeah. But to if you were to, like, I'm going to go and I'm going to yeah. bring the same sign to every college game day— yeah. And stuff that would be super duper duper. This cool. other one uh, we got from Andrew, mm-hmm. the LSU at versus Alabama in Death Valley. If you talk to other sports writers who have been to that, it's like it's unbelievable to go to Death Valley on a bit like Florida or Alabama and see that game. It'll blow your mind. So that's definitely I would do, I would agree with that one. 